Hello everyone, photographer Andre Designs here with a new how-to video. So most of you guys have been asking me how I actually add my actions to the action panel. Most of my videos before I start doing uh, the retouching, I now I'm going to show you guys how to download and add the actions. But I'm going to make a dedicated video for that today. Alright, so the first thing you need to do is to ensure that actions is turned on. Alright, so right here it says actions, you click that and you should have this control panel right here. So what you should do, well, what I normally do is to delete these actions because I don't use the default actions that Photoshop provides. So you come right here where it says clear all actions and you're done. So I'm going to go to my website now, which is andredesigns.com. If you check the link in the description, you'll see a link that takes you directly to the actions. All right. So I'm going to go to tutorials right now. And then I'm going to scroll down here where it says download actions. And these are the actions that you'll be getting. So I'm click download actions. Normally, you'd see a section here if it's the first time you're downloading the action, it's going to tell you to sign in or sign up for the uh, Dropbox. There's an option down here that will take you to the website. It will just say continue to the website. Then you click the download button right here and it says direct download. Oh, this is the page I'm talking about. So it's going to ask you to um, sign up. So you can just say no thanks, continue to download. All right, so I'm going to put it uh, in my documents. You can put it on your desktop or anywhere you wish to load it. So it's now downloaded. So what I'm going to do now is to open the the folder. This is a folder for the actions right here. I'm going to go over to Photoshop and then I'm going to let me just put this back right over. You know what? Let it stay right here. What you could do is to click right here where it has these little um, things here. I'm not sure what they are. And then you can load the action by dragging it inside uh, Photoshop or you can just come here where it says load actions and then you search for where you download the action. I placed mine in the uh, my documents and then you click OK. And then you can turn it into a button by doing this. And let's say you want to um, rearrange the, 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 um, the layout. You take it off the button option and then whatever the action is, you just drag it and remove it and you put it where you'd like to put it. And this can only be done if you're not in the button mode. All right. So I hope this helps. Thank you guys for watching and stay tuned for another video. Bye-bye.